A more humane Mikado never did in Japan exist. To nobody's second, I'm certainly reckoned a true philanthropist. It is my very humane endeavor to make to some extent each evil liver a running river of harmless merriment. Yes, I play Nike Poo, which is a. Uh... He's a prince in disguise, which, I don't know, I play very well. Because... Well, uh, I've done the show several times as Nanki Poo, as co-stage director, as music director, but I've never done it as the Mikado, so this is my first time as the Mikado. Um, what's particularly uh, funny about the particular role that I'm playing is that uh, my father is played by my father. And well, that's actually, he was, uh, he was cast as Nanki Poo first, and then we were discussing how funny it would be if I played the Mikado, then I would be playing his father in the show, and in real life, I am his father, so. Well, we don't end up on the stage together until the last scene. I don't come in until the second act, so I don't have to come to so many rehearsals. Um, he sings the anthem at Canucks Games, is known generally as Mr. O'Canada. So, you get to see me try to step out of his shadow and right back into it. Mm -hmm. I was a goalie, and then he was a goalie, and I was a singer, then he was a singer. Was I was an actor, actor, and then he was an actor, so... Um, I don't know where it goes from there. I'll, I'll die, and he'll probably die, so... With Sean, people say that we have the very similar sense of, senses of humor and quirkiness, but... Uh, so I'm not sure who, uh, I'm not sure if I get it from him or he gets it from me. Uh, I think you should come see it because you get to see my dad and that's kind of like a cool thing. The heir apparent is not slain, but if you want to see him come almost slain, come watch us at the Coast Capital Playhouse, May 9th to 19th. Ah! Mr. O'Canada. Ma. Yeah. <laughs> I shall achieve in time to let the